Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Tripolar, T-R-I-P-O-L-A-R, and welcome back to a brand new video here today on my channel, and we are here doing a how-to Super Mario once again today. So guys, if you're new to this series, make sure you go down below and smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. How to, uh, actually wait, let's try to get over 700 likes on this video. That was such a really weird intro. Because How to Super Mario is a series where we go around and we create different things within the Mario world from things from the past. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm sure you do because you've probably been here for a long time. If you don't, stick around and figure out what it's all about. But as you guys know, we add someone to the garden every time who creates, you know, a really cool build. Um, and I will tell you guys how to do that after we add the newest person who is crazy underscore zombie 45. You have been added to the creative garden for your awesome dry Bowser that you sent me that you're working on. It looks really, really cool. Keep working on it, dude. And that is absolutely awesome. So welcome to the garden. If you guys want your own little shout out and you want to be featured in the video, all you have to do is get in contact with me via Skype. No, not via Skype. I'm sorry. Via Instagram or Twitter. You can follow me on Twitter at Tripolars, Tripolars, uh, T-R-I-P-O-L-A-R-Z, or on Instagram at, at official Tripolar, and you then can send me your builds um, that you've modded, and I will. you have a chance to be added to the garden. But without further ado, guys, we are going to go over today, because today we have a very cool project that we're going to be doing, something brand new. We don't have to really go far for it. We will be training this regular Koopa Troopa into, and if you watched yesterday's live stream, you get this reference, into the Hammer Bro himself, Tyler the MVP. We will be changing this guy into Tyler the MVP today. I literally cannot wait. This is going to be absolutely awesome. So let's start without further ado. Guys, we're going to have to go to the bottom, uh, replace that yellow wool, that yellow wool with white wool, and re replace those wood blocks with uh let's guys let's try to do this all together and do it rather quickly and no 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 uh yeah yeah that's good that's good there you go joseph you can start doing that i'm gonna replace this with uh the wood with stained clay and if you guys could start replacing the blue yeah with blue there you go and can someone get the white carpet on the bottom uh maybe adam will do the white carpet i'm gonna help you guys out and sort of get rid of some of these green blocks because i need to um Oh, sorry, Joseph. I just deleted the block that was right there. Joseph, there's a block right here where that white one is. Um, so just delete it and put the block down. There you go. Joseph, smart. There you go. Attaboy, boy, white cake. Boom. We're, we're getting the start off doing it right away. So we're going to do the uh, hammer. Uh, no, I'm sorry. The boomerang, bro. Um, very, very cool. I really want uh, Mojang to come out with new skin packs. I mean, come on. They really need to come out with a new Mario skin pack with these characters. I know we have one uh, hammer, bro. Hold up. I'm going to actually cha I'll change my skin to him just so you guys can see. Uh, what he actually looks like. I know we have one already, which is right here, but we need the different color ones. I would love different color toads, different color Yoshis, different colored shy guys, um, just different stuff like that. So we got more variety. And then like the babies, like that'd be so cool if we had the bait, like, you know, baby Mario, baby Luigi, um, those guys. I mean, that would just be awesome if we could actually have them. So guys, let's make, let's let, let's be heard and Mojang hear us. Yeah. All the different Kongs. That'd be, I mean, come on. That'd be literally so cool. Toads, uh, Toadsworth, everything like that. That would be awesome. So you guys are going to do that. I'm going to start doing the shell, uh, and we have to replace the black on the shell with actually white. So let me do that first before we get confused. Um, actually we actually might not get confused. Adam, can you come to the top with me? And, uh, and start changing the green on the shell to blue, uh, that same blue that you guys were using down there. Uh, and don't get rid of the black because I'm going to be replacing the black with white. So we're, we should be able to do this relatively quickly. And then hopefully we could all work on the helmet together on the top, which uh, is going to be kind of hard to do it all together. So maybe I will actually start on it right now. Uh, and then you guys can sort of change the rest of the wool uh, on the shell to white. Uh, and then change the rest of the shell to actually green. Or, I mean to blue. All right, so good. You're doing that. The front pretty much stays exactly the same. Arms can stay exactly the same. All right, so let's do the sort of top section. So how the heck am I going to do this? Let me look. Uh, how am I going to do this little helmet thing? So I think I need the first thing I need to do. Oh, I had the color and I just got rid of it. Is take white. And I think right here, uh, I'm going to make a little... Um, thing like this where it looks like that and it looks like this and that will be the start of the helmet right there and then we need like a little black strip in the middle uh, we will use black wool for that so let me go on the other side and do this as well I think that will be fine or is that gonna be too far out do we not want it to be that far out 
And actually, wait, I have a better plan. Let's get rid of this altogether. This whole yellow cheek. Uh, we will get rid of this entire yellow cheek. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. All right, so we got rid of that entire yellow cheek, and we will completely. Uh, hold up. We also need yellow wool because we need to replace some of this, uh, just like this stuff right here. So we can replace that on the two corners. Actually, it's going to be more than the two corners. Um, oh no, it's going to be there. There you go. We're going to do it like that. We're going to go like that, 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 and like that. And that should start to create the illusion of a helmet. Is that going to be, I think that's actually going to be too big. I think we want it like that. Uh, and that will be like sort of our starter start for that starter spot for the helmet and then we could create like a four block thing right there Okay, let's go do this on the other side So we're not forgetting what I'm actually going to be doing if someone wants to attempt to do the mouth They could try to do that, but we're gonna go to we're gonna hit auto save in just a second So you might want to you might want to wait uh, for that in the meantime to do that but Yes, guys, if you did not see the live stream the other day, it was absolutely crazy. It's up on YouTube right now. We played Super, uh, Super, what did we play? Super, what is it called? Super Mario Sl Sluggers. Oh my gosh, that was like so hard for me to say. Um, and it was such a fun live stream. Um, literally ask anyone who watched it. It was probably the best live stream I've ever I mean, definitely, it was the best live stream I've ever done. You have to watch the entire thing or you're not going to get the glory that was in that live stream. Literally, we were all freaking out. People were going crazy. People were crying. I'm joking. People were not crying. That'd be pretty crazy if people started crying during the live stream. That would be uh, pretty insane, folks. I'm not going to lie if that did happen. I just totally messed this up because it needs to go one higher. Whoops. Okay, anyway. Uh, then we're going to go in the middle right here and we're going to put that black. Okay, now we have that section. Now what we need to do is go up from the black and we will go like this. So we go one, two, one, replace this block. So I'm trying to remember this so I can do it on the other side. Then we will go up. When we get to two blocks, we're going to go like up again and we're going to go straight over the top. So we're going to get rid of his eyes, eyebrows or whatever the heck that is. And we're going to go straight over the top like this and then we're going to do that we're gonna go with that 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 replace this block uh wait hold up is this right and then go straight down into a block after wait it should go straight down into a block after i go like this it should go straight down there we go okay let's see how that looks um Let's take a vote. I think it needs to have an extension right here because it would look better if we went like that. Like that. Like that, right? And then we go like this. So like it has a, it has the effect of it's coming over. I think that will look better. Uh, yes, it does. All right. And then from there, what we could do is we'll have that flat area. We will have a three because that's what it is. That's how, that's how big it's going to be. We'll have a three. Uh, and that three will then wrap, go to probably to like there and then uh actually it'll probably go to there then it will actually start to come down and create an illusion of a helmet uh and that is basically what we're going to do and that's how we'll make the helmet um can someone make the someone can probably make the brown chin strap that connects the two things if you if you if you're looking at the thing then you know exactly what i'm talking about when i say the blue chin strap i also have to create the thing that wraps around his whole head so we could just go like this it's going to be quite easy to actually do um we could just go like this pretty much and it should create the illusion that it's going around his entire entirety of his head um from there hold up from there to there to there there we go so it's now going around his whole entire head we will then follow these lines down and i'm going to have to shape this a little bit better so it actually makes the illusion like it's his helmet so let me go like that and that's pretty good for that i think what it is is this is just too high right here and if we did it so that this goes to here instead so if you want to follow this does if you're like trying to follow along and you go off that design that should work now, the only thing we have to do now is grab the blue, uh, and we will put the details in later, of course, but we have to do the blue. You're going to basically go around the whole sides of the head, not touching any of the whites, um, and we're basically just going to make a thing, because that is one layer up, 
So I will do this all the way around uh, because I know they'll probably get confused of what they're trying to do. If they're like trying to replace the, uh, the yellow wool, I would probably get confused too. So I will try to do this myself. I think they're probably attempting to do the mouth, and we will see how that turns out. If we have to fix it, then we will. Um, but hopefully they'll, they'll they'll be able to actually do it. Um, and then, actually, wait, here needs to actually run right alongside that. Um, and this can sort of run right alongside this, like so. That can replace that. This can replace this and actually go up to that level. Um, this is definitely not going to be symmetric on both sides, which I think will be okay because it will still give the look that it's pretty symmetric, but we do need this to only be to one layer. Perfect. All right. Yeah. Yeah. This is definitely going to be need to be shaped more to actually look like a helmet because right now it sort of looks like a lump on his head. Uh, probably from the front, it looks a little bit different, but, uh, let's see. Okay. That's actually not too bad. If we look at it from that angle, that's actually looks pretty good. Uh, it's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, now we could go from this side and do the exact same thing over again, where we sort of delete the yellow and replace it with the blue. Um, and we can sort of go like that. We can sort of get rid of all these blocks that are going to be blocking. Yeah, yeah. Well, okay. If anything, anything that will make it more accurate. You, you are one hundred. And 10% have my uh, permission of doing. YK just asked if you can make the eyes blue. Because apparently in the picture that we're using of a, as a reference is blue. So uh, that would make sense, YK, if, his, if it was blue. Just saying, buddy. Just saying. It would make sense. All right. Anyway, let's get back into this. So we're going to do that. We are then going to sort of create the illusion that it's right up to his head. Just like the other one was. Then we're going to have to fill in these blocks. So it's only one block away. Go like that, go like that, go like that, get rid of these, go like that, go like that, that, and more of this, more of that, and finally, we'll just do something like that, and that looks pretty similar to the other side, I would say. I mean, they look sort of similar. I think what I have to do to actually make them look more similar is to sort of have more equal, um, Something like that. So I'm make it a little more equal looking. See how that's like a little more equal now? Um, oh my gosh, YK, what did you do to his eyes? His poor eyes, YK. He looks crazy. He looks insane. You need some buttons on those eyes. Nah, you need more. Whoa, whoa, what are you, whoa, what are you doing, folks? All you have to do to make this better. I know, I know. Tripolar will fix it. Don't worry, don't worry, folks. Tripolar will fix it. There we go. Now he looks normal again. Actually, no, he kind of looks crazy. Uh, so what you have to do to not make him look crazy is just go like that. There you go. Now he looks adorable. <laughs> there you go, folks. That's all you have to try. Polar eyes. One, two, three. Whoa! His mouth looks like he's a guppy. <laughs> you guys made his mouth look like he's a little guppy. Does it look good from the front? That's all that matters. No, it does not. Okay, we're gonna have to fix his mouth, guys. He looks like a. He lo actually looks like a straight up guppy. All right, so what we're gonna do is we have to sort of make his nose. Oh my gosh, we have to make his nose more pointy. So let's grab some yellow wool. Uh, not like that. At, not not like that, Adam. That is dumb. You have to make his nose like this, guys. All right, ready? You're gonna go like that. You have to make it more of like a uh, more of a symmetric. Oh no no no! It's gotta be. Wait wait wait! Hold up hold up! Don't don't place box. Even like that, it's going to be more symmetric. And then this is his mouth literally right under his beak. So, guys, delete that whole bottom thing because that's just not right. So, whoever did that whole bottom thing, just uh, make, just get rid of it for now. And no one touch this for right now so I could just do it easily. Um, basically, we're going to make his mouth black. You won't be able to see it. It's going to be nice. Uh, we'll go like that. And we'll go like that. And then obviously I'll have to make adjustments after this. I'll also have to see how it looks and, uh, and make adjustments from there. But from right now, I think we can say that if we do that, and then we have his little red tongue, and then he has his red tongue sort of sticks out, sort of doesn't. So I guess we could do something like that. Um, and oh my goodness, what is this thing at the bottom? Okay, this can all go away, guys, because he doesn't have a double chin um, at all. Oh, wait, this is not you guys. This is just the actual builders. All right, so can, can you guys replace that so that actually looks normal and doesn't look like he has a double chin? Okay, right, don't delete all of it. Don't delete all of it because we still need some of it, folks. We still need some of it. Um, 
and he's going to have sort of a oops oops a days ago sort of a sort of mouth kind of going on um whoa okay he's, he's he's getting there he's getting there he just needs um this okay well first of all the under is can someone fix under and replace look under it and replace those blocks like uh delete the the redstone and, and put it back um i think what it is is it it's this part if we go like that how does does that give it oh that doesn't actually look too bad guys what do you think yk what do you think does that look like a, i mean it, it looks like him right all right well uh why is he yeah yk yk approved exactly all right guys yk approved so obviously it's the best thing ever so uh we're good we're good to go we don't need anything more um this kind of looks like its own little beast right here its own creature i don't really seem to like that so i'm gonna do like that sort of make his nose more pointy and there you go so guys there you go himself the mvp in our world actually it looks it looks pretty good i actually like this this is one of the best ones we've done oh guys you did not ever fix the shell are you serious folks hold up folks we gotta fix the shell because uh they don't know how to do it um all right guys but that is going to be it for today's episode if you guys did enjoy it make sure you leave a like down below if you're new to this series make sure to subscribe and uh, let me know what you guys want to say. Of course, if you want to be added, do that stuff that I said to be added. And I will do give you one last sort of lookout at the, at the entire thing. So uh, here he is. So that is from the side. You can see that he looks like that. Um, from the front, he's looking like, uh, he's looking like a G. And uh, from this side, he's also looking very cool. So guys, if you enjoyed it, make sure you go and smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, like, subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!